We're learning new information about yesterday's deadly synagogue shooting in Poway near San Diego. Witnesses say Lori Gilbert Kay, the woman killed in the attack, stepped in front of the shooter to protect the synagogue's rabbi. We've also learned that the family of an eight-year-old girl wounded in the shooting moved from Gaza to escape the violence in Israel. And a 34-year-old man who was also wounded was apparently trying to carry children out of the synagogue when he was shot in the leg. Now, the suspected shooter, 19-year-old John Ernest, after he was arrested near San Diego, police say Ernest walked into Chabad of Poway with an AR-style assault rifle and opened fire. An off-duty border patrol who was on the security team confronted Ernest during a gunfight, but the suspect got away. Three people were wounded. A synagogue employee says Lori Gilbert Kay, who stepped between the rabbi and the gunman, was a big contributor to a nonprofit within the synagogue. She uh, was one of our major donors, um, and she was just very active with, with helping us, um, and also very active with the shul, like helping how she can and volunteering all the time. So she's just a very generous person. Police say Ernest surrendered to officers a short time later. In an apparent manifesto posted online, the suspected shooter described his hatred for Jews and appeared to draw inspiration from the mosque shootings in New Zealand. Now, in that manifesto, he wrote, To my family and friends, I can already hear your voices. How could you throw your life away? You had everything. Loving family, great friends, a church. You were doing well in nursing school. Then he writes about his hate for Jews. No, I will not sell my soul by sitting idly by as evil grows. I'd rather die in glory or spend the rest of my life in prison than waste away knowing that I did nothing to stop this evil.